On the last video, JD Ross taught you how to install Alan Wake 2 via Lutris. But now we have a new one that will surely make things easier for you. My name is Matt, and today we're going to talk about a better and easier method to install the cracked version of Alan Wake 2. For our first step, make sure that you are on Steam OS Beta or Preview and have it updated to the latest version. This will ensure that you'll have the mesh shader that the game requires. While the game will still work without the mesh shaders, having it will help reduce graphical glitches and performance issues. By the way, Alan Wake 2 from Dodi just got updated to version 1.0.9, so if you're doing this, you might as well update to it before proceeding. OK, let's continue. Go to wherever you installed the game. Right-click on alanwake2.exe and click Add to Steam. Now install Proton Tricks from the Discover Store and open it. If the game is missing, close Proton Tricks for a moment. Go to Properties. Compatibility. Set this to Proton Experimental. Run the game once. It won't launch, but that's OK. Now run Proton Tricks again. It should now be there. Choose the game and click OK. Click OK. Click here, then click OK. Check D3D Compiler 43 and 47, scroll down and check VC Run 2022. Then click OK. The dependencies are being downloaded in the background, so be patient. In fact, it took 37 seconds before the first one even appeared. Now go install them, there should be a second one. When you see this, that means you're done with the dependencies. Now click Cancel, twice. In the description, there should be a download link. Download the file. Now open it. Then go to Home, Deck, and drag the Mesa folder in it. Now copy this command from the description. Go to the game on Steam. Go to Properties. Then paste it in the launch options. And there we go. You can now play the game and there won't be any missing textures anymore. No more untextured tree branches. No more missing FBI logos. All textures are now there. So that's it. Go enjoy the game. And if you want to transfer your save file from the Lutris install to the Steam install, click the video in the description and JD Roz will help you out. If you want more videos like this, make sure to hit like and subscribe. Once again, my name is Matt. Thank you for watching and see you soon.